Image props are included in any version of Vectorworks. That includes the RenderWorks package. Contrary to its name, it actually utilizes a texture rather than simply an image in order to appear as if it was a 3D object. If you would like to learn how to create an image prop, please watch the Creating Image Props video first. This video can be found here. Probably the most common use of an image prop is to provide a 3D component for plants. Not only does this result in a faster file, as opposed to a user attempting to model every branch and leaf individually in 3D, it also creates a much more realistic appearance as the base image used for an image prop is often an actual photograph of a plant itself, making photorealism much easier to achieve. Another common use is to replace human figures or entourage figures with either photorealistic image props of people or even a simpler shadow or outline representation of individuals standing, moving around, or interacting with your model. Probably the easiest to configure, but most overlooked use, is an image prop's ability to create an entire vista outside of a window or doorway in your document. You can simply use an image found online, or if you have access to the site itself, you can even take a picture from the appropriate vantage point in each direction and then add those images as props, showing the client exactly what they'll see outside of their windows each day. A few less common but exceedingly useful places for image props include fireplaces and candlelight, steam and smoke effects, and quickly adding hobby items, pets and toys based upon the user's likes and interests. Image props let you add very detailed yet very easy to manipulate objects in just a few minutes, allowing you to custom tailor your design either to a particular client or simply to give it your own personal touch. Thank you for joining us, and don't forget to visit kbase.vectorworks.net for more video tech tips and other technical info. Thank you, and have a great day.